Right, so a lot of political content creators online on social media, and it doesn't matter whether they are left-wing grifters or right-wing grifters. Mainly people on the right wing, though, they tend to say this thing where music influences people to do bad things. But then again, using that logic, it could also influence them to do good things. Now, focusing on the music influences you to do bad things, I personally have to respectfully disagree. And in order to provide a valid example, I will have to use myself. So having lived in multiple countries, having experienced multiple cultures, having friends across the world. One thing that has happened is that my music taste is a bit all over the place, right? So I enjoy Sudna by Molkat Dama, Russian music. I enjoy uh, Nox, Hungarian band. I enjoy, I don't know, some Finnish songs, some Latin songs. I enjoy Tahitian drums from the Bounty series of films. I enjoy Caribbean music, Latin American music. I enjoy European operas, you know, Mozart and Beethoven. But because I lived in America and because of the friends I had there, I also have quite a liking to gangster rap. You know, I'm a fan of Lil Durk, Montana 300, these types of people. Really a big fan of Lil uh, Montana 300's Dancing With My AK song. I think the lyrics and that are super creative. Now, just because I enjoy listening to Montana 300 talk about how his clip hangs so low that he calls it Rapunzel, or when his bullet shells are flipping like the Ninja Turtles, that doesn't mean that I'm going to start going after any ops. Just because I enjoy Tahitian drums entrance from the 1962 film Mutiny on the Bounty with Marlon Brando and Trevor Howard. It doesn't mean that I'm suddenly going to go on the ship and overthrow the captain. Just because I enjoy, I don't know, Mozart's music doesn't mean that I'm going to live in the Holy Roman Empire. No. So I disagree with the fact that music influences you because for me personally, because I have such a combined taste in music there isn't really a certain band that's my favorite there's not a certain artist that's my favorite i you know it really is a mix of nox in hungary to montana of 300 in atlanta georgia to i don't know molkat dama sudna or some other russian songs so i don't understand this point where people say music influences you because Although, actually, during my exam period, you were allowed to listen to music, and one thing that really did help was listening to Dax and Lil Durk. I don't know why. But does that mean that if I listen to Dax, I'm going to, I don't know, keep drinking until I'm someone I don't recognise? Probably not. Does that mean that if I continuously listen to Lil Durk's Make It Out, that means that I was so high that I wish I replied to LA's text while I was in LAX? No. So music doesn't influence you. You can appreciate the lyrics. I don't like Dancing With My AK because I'm a big fan of gangster rap. I like Dancing With My AK. Yes, it technically falls under this gangster rap, world star, hip hop genre, fine. But in my opinion, the lyrics of that song, that rap song especially, are super creative. You know, they've got so many, if any of you are former media students, intertextuality. They've got so many media references. They've got Disney references with Rapunzel, Ninja Turtles. I mean, what's not to like? But it doesn't influence me. It doesn't make me want to become some gangster in Atlanta, Georgia, who dances with his quote-unquote AK. Then again, listening to Knox doesn't m make me want to, I don't know, hug someone a hundred times, translated. So if you are someone who thinks that music does influence people to do bad things, then hopefully you understand why I respectfully disagree. Now, you can maintain that opinion, that's fine, but in my case, I don't see the logic there. 